Hi guys, it's Chrissy with Chrissy's Divine Design Tarot, and today we're doing a reading for <laughs> uh, King Taeyang and Future Spouse. Okay, we're doing things a little differently today. All right. Wow, everything's in reverse. Maybe I'll flip my deck. Oh, maybe. <laughs> okay. What else do we have for Taeyang and V, I guess you could say? All right. Hmm. Well, for starters, the wheel's in reverse. So we're looking at Jupiter. This is about luck. So something might be repeating, a cycle maybe. There might be delay or trying to control a situation. Maybe unable to adapt to something. This may be justice in reverse, which is Libra, which is about values. So there may be karmic debts that need to be paid here. This could be a hidden agenda. Something's unbalanced here. It's unwelcome change of some sort. The Five of Cups here. Hmm. Somebody's very disappointed, maybe going over the emotional baggage here. So I'm kind of really getting that Somebody was trying to control something that's now out of balance. And uh, the Five of Cups here, I, I'm really feeling like this is a loss or a sadness of some sort. It could be just disappointments or dealing with some emotional baggage. Maybe they had some type of truth or they want the truth. And something is quite the burden. They may be looking at long-term family. He may see long-term and family right now to be a bit of a burden to him. He may not have love in the equation at this time. I feel like he's just looking for new beginnings. All the paths are open to him. And the five of pentacles in reverse. So this is kind of telling me that there may be some ongoing challenges here, some type of hardship, maybe a loss or insecurity of some type. Not wanting to feel like a fool here. Let's look at what the energy is for Tai Young's person. Codependency. So not looking for anyone that can't be on their own or has to be with them all the time. Has to be their happiness because being codependent, if you don't know what that is, Looking that up might be a good idea, especially when it comes to relationships. You may find that you've done this in the past or that you're doing this now, but Kin Taeyang here, I'm kind of feeling maybe some type of addictions of some sort. It may just be that he can't be on his own. He likes having company all the time or his person does. But he has romantic feelings. Um, they're real and they're worth exploring towards somebody that may be codependent. Let's see what else this person feels. Wants to get to know each other here. And what about V? Let go of control issues. Okay, so yeah, somebody's trying to control something here, like I said earlier. So let's look at what some of the intentions are that V has here. Maybe wanting things to go the way he wants it. Having somebody codependent here is maybe a people pleaser. 
Yeah, relationship is evolving to the next phase, maybe healing things. Um, and he may want to be kind of happily single, living for the moment kind of energy. What about his person? Oh, they're making healthy choices, self-love. So maybe getting over this codependency here. Oh, this may be a twin flame union here. Aha. Uh -huh. So this person sees him as his twin flame. So let's break the deck here. Hmm. Looks like stability, security, performance, growth here. So there is growth happening here between these two, which is beautiful. There's that twin flame energy and and just maybe wanting to be happily single, not really in anything. If he's going to be any romantic feelings, he wants to be in control of that. Um, possibly for his career, he might have to adapt or have somebody that's able to adapt, can be on their own without him being with them every second of the day because he's busy with his work and whatnot here. Let's see, what is this Wheel of Fortune in reverse? Hmm, yeah. Looking at himself as being single, being good all on his own. And with the Wheel of Fortune in reverse here, this is kind of like delaying a love, um, something that will be lucky in love. This is kind of having bad luck um, and having struggles here, probably because he's not embracing love and love is the highest frequency there is here. Work is not everything. Money is not everything without love. You can have all the money in the world, but if you have no one to share it with, what good is having that money? I really, if you feel alone, I'm feeling lonely. And not knowing if people are there for you or for your money. So... Let's see what we have for the justice in reverse here. Yeah, somebody does not want to miss out on an opportunity here. Somebody may have poured out a blessing earlier on. This may be somebody that's a runner chaser type of dynamic. This could be someone from his past that they kind of get together and maybe just are always friends, but there's more there if they let it happen. Let's see what the Five of Cups is in reverse. Hmm. Yeah, the the Nine of Wands in reverse. So this is kind of telling me that kind of almost wanting to give up because the challenges are so um, kind of very burdening. This is like wanting to move forward but it's, it's such a challenge there's so challenging you almost wants to give up when it comes to things not just doesn't it just just wants to stay at home and not do anything it's kind of almost a depressed kind of thing yeah he's not giving out any uh, offers spirit says that's the truth here he may not really want to, like this is our slow and steady wins the race. And right now he might be going through quite a lot of karma here. It looks like, yeah, things are a burden in the, the heart of the reading here. Yeah, he's not really looking at marriage. Maybe somebody he knows is going through a divorce or he may be worried about getting married because of a divorce. He doesn't want to have to go through a divorce. Why is the Hierophant in reverse here? Yeah, it feels like it's too risky right now. Maybe trying to find the right person to marry. Maybe feel it's too risky. Yeah, he's not good with self right now. He's got the Nine of Cups in reverse. So I'm kind of getting with this. It's more or less kind of unfilled or broken promises that he has about love that maybe happened when it came to a certain somebody, maybe this twin flame. 
Why is the lovers in reverse? Yeah, something's not working when it comes to the magician maybe manifesting things. Some type of confusion or maybe some cheating. Could be just romantic illusions when it comes to people. They may have a, a preconceived notion about what should happen instead of letting it just be in the flow. This is the lover's card in reverse, which is that Gemini energy. This is a breakup or argument here. This might be a work romance here, but there may have been some cheating going on here or some type of romantic illusion. What's the fool here? It's usually a good card. It's usually about new beginnings. All paths are open, wanting to take that leap of faith. Oh, he is wanting to take this leap of faith here into growing into the emperor energy here. I feel like it's like, this is the emperor's like that Aries passionate um, type of energy, the, all that stability and everything and wealth. And he's got kind of, whatever he wants right now, that spiritual traditions, values, his purpose. He wants to take a leap of faith when it comes to his purpose. The five of cups here in reverse. Yeah, that's right. So this is about moving forward, moving forward on a positive change here. What do we got? This is coming out of poverty or some type of financial struggle. There's a queen of wands here. This is somebody that has a temper, maybe revengeful here. Her way or the highway, kind of domineering here. Why is the queen of wands in reverse? Ah, there's a tower moment here. Everything's coming down around him. When right now, there might be some type of karma that's played out here right down to the bottom of that hill everything's crumbling let's see what lessons were learned here what do we got for lessons get to know each other, learn to meet another's need for love. So perhaps there was just all about him type of energy instead of looking at his person's needs as well. Maybe not demonstrating enough love, find out what's important to those you love and act on it. So perhaps not having, knowing this person enough to know what they want for love from him. This is eight, that's 12. So that ends up being a three. That's growth here. And growing about these lessons. Mm, and I love you. Uh, these are powerful words, maybe aren't said often. And let's see here for your person, Taeyang B, what do we have? Appreciate this moment, every situation in an opportunity to grow and find love. So I'm kind of feeling this is something that is his. This is his ascended masters, not taking love into account. He really didn't want to do any love, any type of love here. may have been just kind of being a free-for-all <laughs> kind of not really um taking anybody serious romantically let's see like attracts like if you long for more love be more loving so this is for his person when it comes to things maybe gets uptight or angry about things instead of just living in the moment Simple acts of kindness, being kind energizes you and brings happiness to those around you. So maybe not being 
kind with words. Perhaps there's some type of anger or resentment here between the two. Actions speak loudly. Perhaps he has broken promises here. Um, all talk and no action. Express love through actions. So this person may be in a lot of talk and not acting on it. Or maybe it was V. Appreciate this moment. This is coming back out for both of them about the opportunity to grow and find love. So if things weren't growing, things broke down here. But this could have been um, some karma towards V if he was the one to cheat here because we do have cheating energy here. So let's see one more for his person. Be supportive. Perhaps this person wasn't supportive enough for V when it came to wish fulfillment. And what is the bottom of the deck? Yeah, actions speak loudly. Express your love through actions. And perhaps it was they both would say that what they were going to do, but never act on that. So let's see what we have for what actions they are going to do towards one another. What's V's action towards this person? What is he going to do towards this person? His person. Oh. Ah, the rainbow. Wish granted. There's a blessing here. Abundance. Good luck. Things are turning around for him. This tower has broken everything down and may have, have his karma end here. Maybe manifesting wealth, prosperity. I feel like with the cancer energy there that's loyalty he may be looking at being loyal now when it comes to love yeah having a new beginning desiring sex procreation a sudden increase clever resourceful multiply <laughs> he may be just thinking about hookups not so much anything else let's see yeah he's He's a public speaker, you could say. He broadcasts things. <laughs> he communicates on social media. He's being heard and he's speaking up. This is Sagittarius energy. So 918 might be a number to have for him, his angel numbers with another message. Wow, we have ring. Wow, wow, wow. So there is somebody he would like to commit to, it looks like. There's some telepathy here, which is that twin flame dynamic where they can speak. Well, everybody can, but it's about knowing how. And I feel like these two have a sense of what they're feeling and who they feel for. They feel their energy, even when they're not... Just when they're close by, they can feel their energy and maybe have this type of need to look out the window, want to know who drove by because you could feel that person. This is a partner. This is a strong connection, a bond. This is a soulmate. This is Gemini. So 9182 may be a good one to look up another angel number for V. And what about his person? Uh, there might be stress and anxiety here. Some fear, maybe nagging. Uh, I kind of felt that about that um, not being supportive or whatever one it was here for lessons. Maybe not being very kind in their words. This is changing with the number five. And seven of clubs is that seven of wands and that's overcoming challenges things are starting to change this is a, po a position of advantage this is against all odds this is having this personal strength and integrity here so this person overcomes some of these challenges here baby wow this is a new beginning this is continuing the legacy this is somebody that might be needy 
which would have been right with the codependency here, vulnerable. It's a fresh start. I feel like there's going to be some forgiveness here. This is Aries, Cancer, Libra, and Capricorn energy. We have Scorpio, the universe, source, infinite. So this person may be getting in touch with their higher perspective. They're seeing the big picture here and how the law of one is. This is awakening. This is a creative force. You may get downloads from this. This is number five, seven, seven, five, seven, seven. Let's get one more and four, five, seven, seven, four. This is roots, comfort, safety. They're looking for that structure, that shelter. They have boundaries as well. And with the king of cups here, this is kind of telling me that this is somebody that's kind of got the wisdom and are emotionally balanced. They're generous and compassionate. They want that, that stability with number four there. Maybe a good manifester as well. What's their energy between the two? Oh, they're going to find a solution here. They're going to get that clarity. They're going to pay attention. I feel like this is going to bring in the solution. There's intelligence here. And this is Ascended Masters coming in with number 33. The Eight of Diamonds is the Eight of Pentacles, which is all about mastering something here, being the apprentice and dictating things or it's about commitment, mastering commitment here, a skill, this insight. They're both going to work on things, I feel. So let's look at the outcome for Taeyang V. What's the outcome? Okay, there's a message of concern for V. Yeah, he's feeling stuck right now because of all this karma. He may be feeling a little immature or there might be children in his energy, maybe siblings or siblings' children. He's concentrating on his occupation here and working endlessly with the toil and labor works hard in that industry but he keeps thinking about this person that he wants to put a ring on it yeah there's sudden wealth here due to his um occupation yeah he is a wealthy man here and there may be a thief in his energy here that may be what the message of concern is what about his person what about his person hmm courthouse with number five there's a change here somebody might be taking someone to court maybe that's where this thief is could be this person is a lawyer or wants knows somebody in the courthouse to help him with this against this thief there's a journey here they may be buying a house, that stability. We did see house already here. Yeah, this is an official person from the courts here. What is this about? This is in the distant horizon. This has to do with fruition or fulfillment. People might find out about this court case. Somebody might have to go to find out something to do with court here and a house. Someone of a privileged lady. There's some unexpected income going on here. And what else do we have? Yes, it might be um, a male here that is Maybe trying to take unexpected income from a privileged lady here. She might be taking this person to court about this house. This may be 
something he's thinking about because he has thoughts of the sudden wealth from a wealthy man and a thief so he may be thinking about someone trying to take money from somebody here might be the talk of the town or the internet I guess what's their combined energy hmm yeah, there's some despair here, something to do. And I feel like he's maybe worried about this feminine here. This may be somebody that's already in a relationship here. Trying to grow and ascend. And I feel like yet this may be him, thoughts about him, about what's going on in her world. Let's see, what is this message of concern? Hmm, has to do with the King of Cups, and I'm going to say that's that main male. Yeah, somebody's wanting to come out of poverty here when it comes to this feminine. What's this privileged lady? Hmm, Queen of Cups, so she's not so nice here. With her being in the reverse, this is somebody that's emotionally draining, and manipulative, needy, and clingy. So... There may be a friend of this privileged lady that is kind of upsetting her or may have something to do with this main male. This is a new person. This isn't somebody from the past. The Wheel of Fortune is going to turn in this person's favor, though. Two of Pentacles in reverse. This is kind of being overcommitted. Yeah, having too much going on. Somebody's wanting to reconcile, and I'm going to say it's this man here. So I kind of feel like he's very concerned. He's emotionally stable. This may be a message of concern about somebody that is coming out of poverty here this I kind of feel like this has to do with her something's going on with her yeah there's justice here so with the courthouse here somebody's getting justice somebody's having to pay some karmic debt here karmic debts are being paid I'm feeling here Somebody's doing the right thing here, trying to balance out their energy. There's that solution, that key here. Yeah, something comes to an end here completely. They have all the tools to end this, to wrap this up, to end uh, uh, tie up loose ends here. Yeah, somebody was very greedy with the Four of Pentacles in reverse. Very greedy and misuse of money. And I feel like it had to do with this sudden wealth. Or this unexpected income. Yeah, walking away. So this privileged lady is walking away from all the people that no longer are good for her. And I feel like this person is included, this new friend. I feel like this privileged lady walks away. I feel like this is his twin flame here. The one he wants to put the ring on. She's going through her own thing. He's going through his thing. But yet he's still thinking about her. And what she may be going through. He may know her. Yeah. He's. I feel like there's some. A lot of options. That he could take or she can and I feel like he's chosen her cup already he may know who he wants to be with yeah there's no there's no victory right now because I feel like they're both going through their own thing but marriage is on the table here I had somebody that wanted to know is there going to be a breakup and a marriage this year and I feel like he's going through some karma here from a breakup already. And it looks like marriage is on the horizon here with the ring. So with a soulmate, I feel like this is somebody he knows. This could be somebody from his past. This could be a new person. 
Let's see, what's the ring here? I'm going to keep that one out. Right now he's not having a victory because he's not with this person. She's dealing with her own thing. He's dealing with his. Let's see. Queen of Swords. Somebody's taking revenge here. There's revenge here. Cruel, dangerous, and deceitful. Really malicious and talking shit here. Having some type of empty victory here. Feeling like they won anyway. This may have been some type of plot here. What's the ring? Hmm. Yeah, I feel like these two may have um, cleared things up. Who he wants to put this ring on the finger here the three of hearts in reverse or three of swords in reverse sorry this is all about healing forgiving and letting go of whatever happened between the two of them so what whoever this is yeah this could be a capricorn this could be v's energy or this could be his person's energy here this is all about temptation and desire, but I feel like he really just desires this person. There's a lot of passion here. What's the ring, please? Yeah, his empress. His empress is coming out. He sees her as her empress. I feel like when she uh, ends whatever this is with this person from her past, goes through the court, gets her karma, she's getting... Her justice for something now whether that is justice for the karma he's going through um, but she's kind of going through her own thing here and she may be getting justice for somebody trying to take money from her but there's a change on the horizon here what's their intuition telling them let's see what's the intuition telling them yeah now, the sun in reverse, this is all about something being unhappy right now, something being immature or unsuccessful right now. So right now, things aren't going their way when it comes to them coming together. Yeah, somebody had a lesson to learn, and I feel like it may have been her. She had to learn something here that's going to help her grow. I feel like codependency may have been the issue and learning about self-worth here. Yeah, that hermit, healing self, going and doing that dark night of the soul, pulling out all the snakes that are maybe in their area, having people that are loyal around them. Yeah, with the hermit. What about Tai Young V? Okay, so with the Ten of Swords in reverse, this is kind of telling me this is lessons learned, and I feel like this could be her or him or both. I kind of feel like it's lessons learned for both of them. They're both learning some lessons here. What's the next action between them? Ooh, <laughs> so we have the bonfire. Something's heating up here. Something's getting intense. There's ecstasy here, a spark here, getting things going. Orgasm is here, fiery, fierce. Yeah, this is intense. There's a lot of joy. Something's igniting here. This is Sagittarius energy. So the next thing to come up is going to be some fire energy. <laughs> so Leo Aries Sag um, could also be, I'm kind of feeling with that Capricorn, Capricorn Taurus Virgo, the earth signs here. And the Empress is Venus is all about love. And that is who he's seeing here is his Empress with the rings. So there you have it. This is um, King Taeyang 
uh, and future spouse. So this is what I have for right now. They're not together still, but things are starting to be learned here. Codependency is being learned. There's some dark night of the soul. There's some healing happening here. Things that are wrapping up, loose ends that are being tied. And he's thinking about what she's going through. He may feel her despair through the telepathy that they have. They feel each other's energy. It's like um, being connected. And it's amazing when these two will get together because the energy between them, it will be nothing they've ever felt before. It just intensifies with every union that they have. And the more and more they get together, the more and more energy they produce. So when they are not together, they can really feel the other person, even if they can't see them, if they're in their vicinity. So this is what I have. I hope you enjoyed the reading. Things are really going to turn around soon, I feel for these guys they still haven't come together they are somebody that was from the past i feel like there was a breakup between them and uh, possibly they had to grow there was lessons needing to be learned here so any case take care guys we'll see you next time stay blessed all right later